The Force is with you, young Skywalker. But you are not a Jedi yet. Hey, what is up, YouTube fam? It's Dupree, aka Darth Hater here. And we have some new Star Wars news. Very, very new. This case came out today. So, this is uh, from a promo called Next on Disney Plus. It was, a, it was a long, like, a trailer. I watched it uh, earlier today. There's a bunch of things coming to Disney Plus in 2021. And then um, they talked about, like, documentaries also. Uh, so, they featured. Things like Marvel Legends and then Star Wars, the Mandalorian and everything, which they f featured a quick snippet of like Luke Skywalker, Mark Hamill on set and the Grogu puppet and everything like waving. It's confirmed what I already knew uh, right after the episode, the season finale of Rescue, I already knew it was Mark Hamill. They even said it, announced it like after that episode came out that Mark Hamill was on set, he had a stunt double. I knew when I announced it, when they dropped the headline uh, way back when, that uh, this was actually what he was actually on set for it, and basically just confirmed it with this picture. Uh, anyway, I'll, let's let's read what this says. So, Star Wars first look at Mark Hamill's on-set Luke Skywalker return in The Mandalorian. Star Wars icon Mark Hamill is back in black and back on set as the legendary Luke Skywalker and the new look at the upcoming Disney gallery gallery the Mandalorian making a season two finale see yeah this is the thing like you know I was waiting for they did the Disney gallery uh, for the Mandalorian season two everything from you know all Grogu uh, Katie so Sackoff coming back you know even Ahsoka and then Boba Fett but they didn't do anything about Luke Scout they didn't they didn't barely they didn't even show him at all so I was a little surprised that they uh, waited this long so what, like nine months or so, like after eight or nine months or so after the uh, episode airs, we're finally getting it. The previously announced special uh, premiered August 25th on Disney Plus, offers a exclusive behind the scenes look at the making of chapter 16, The Rescue. Revealing how Disney uh, Lucasfilm artist digitally de-aged and recreated a younger you Luke and season two finale of The Mandalorian, set five years after 1983 Star Wars Episode Six: Return of the Jedi. The episode marks Hamill's uh, surprise reprisal of the role he last returned to Star Wars: uh, The Rise of Skywalker in 2019. Yeah, so um, it, it's funny because uh, I remember when that episode aired, uh, you know, they all had us up in, in tears. Like that was just it, like. If you were a Star Wars fan growing up, that like basically woke woke up the child inside you. Just seeing, you know, old school Luke Skywalker handle and do like you know everything we wanted to see him do after like all these years. But the funny thing is like everybody loved it. It was like a little bit of naysayers because you know the fans, uh, Star Wars, especially Star Wars fans, were spoiled. We're gonna nitpick everything, which is a good thing sometimes and a sad thing also times. It's funny with the de-aging process with, um, you know, all these actors, they, they do a good job, but then also sometimes, sometimes they do, you know, whatever job, like, you know, they have that deep faker now, the, um, the YouTube deep faker that just got hired by Lucasfilm to do all the new, um, you know, de-aging, you know, for everything coming up. So who knows, maybe, you know what, they might um, go back and redo um, Mark Hamill's face in this uh, kind of like you know how like uh, I figure what episode that was in season two where um, there was a guy in the background and they digitally took him out and it was a crew man that just like randomly showed up like whoops uh oh and the latest next on Disney Plus trailer for August 2021 get a look at an unhooded Hamill holding Grogu aka Baby Yoda when Luke and the and droid psychic R2-D2 come to collect the force powerful Padawan from bounty hunter Din Djarin, Pedro Pascal. So, um, Disney Gallery, um, Star Wars and Mandalorian, Season 2, Episode 2, uh, August 25th, 2021. And it has a picture here of Hamill, with Mark holding uh, Grogu with R2 next to him. I can't tell what this crew dude, this crew man is doing like on the floor, but whatever. It was very tricky because it was hard to keep a secret nowadays, especially with Star Wars, because people are so curious about it. 
Mandalorian series creator John Favreau previously told Good Morning America about Hamill's top secret cameo made possible with the help of body double Max Lord Jones. I wonder if that's the same dude who was who did the body double for him for him in Force Awakens. If you guys didn't know, there was a deleted scene uh, when Ray touches the lightsaber and it shows Luke fighting Vader due to the corridor and Vest Pen. And they had a body double, so I don't know if this is the same guy or that was a different guy, but that's whatever. Because every piece of casting leaked ahead of episode two, including Tamora Morrison as Boba Fett and Katie Sackhoff as a live action Bo Katan Kreese for the first time. We were so scared right up until chapter 16 aired that a surprise cameo was going to leak too, Fabril said. Mm. The fact that we were able to keep my involvement a secret for over a year with no leaks is nothing less than a miracle, my humble treat in December. Calling the season's best kept episode a real triumph for spoiled haters everywhere. Disney Disney describes this special episode of Disney Gallery The Mandalorian as a behind the scenes look at the making of this celebrated chapter of The Mandalorian with a focus on the technology used for recreating Luke Skywalker. It develops into the collaborative process including working with Mark Hamill to create an authentic and fitting recreation and explores the immense pressure and responsibility the filmmakers had to bring back one of the most important characters in film history. Season 3 of The Mandalorian is expected to begin production soon for a 2022 debut, following spinoff The Book of Boba Fett coming later this year on Disney+. Plus. And everything. And the uh, thing is coming out May, August 25th. Yeah, you know, um, I wonder if it's going to cover that whole episode or just like the whole thing with just Mark Hamill. And if it's just, I think if it's the whole episode, it might be an hour, but I think if it's just... You know, the thing with Mark Hamill and uh, Luke Skywalker probably will be like in like 40 minutes or whatever. Uh, I want to see if they actually interviewed him on set, like, you know, little snippets from behind the scenes. Because they did that with everybody else. Like, they followed, you know, they had camera crews and, and everything following um, um, Rosario Dawson as Ahsoka. And same thing with Boba Fett. They did a lot of BTS for all that. So I wonder if we're going to have the same thing for this. It's kind of funny like uh you can tell totally, you can totally tell like uh a lot of companies were waiting for this to drop so they could drop their merchandise like even uh even hot toys released their one six scale like uh luke skywalker from the mandalorian literally today as uh this this news drops so i'm just you know it's a little like i wouldn't be surprised if like you know more uh, like Funk, well, probably they're gonna do uh, Funko, like Skywalker from The Mandalorian, and some more figures or whatever from whatever series. Because newest appearance of Luke Skywalker over the was a slight costume change, uh, a variation in his costume with Rogue One R2. Like, that's come on, given. Um, it's gonna be cool. So, August 25th, uh, we'll definitely probably be doing a uh, pre live stream and then a video right after that. So definitely stay tuned. But uh, let me know what you guys th think about this. Let me know if you guys are going to be watching. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Or actually, let me know if you guys are going to get that damn hot toys. Like, I ordered the Ahsoka. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the Boba Fett. Uh, and. Um, do I do all that? I have to have Luke Skywalker. Thing about me, I don't do hot toys, but unless it's a you know character I really really like, love, uh, I'm gonna have to. Anyway, guys, uh, if you guys like this video, please hit that like button. Uh, if you are not subscribed to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. And if you could be so kind as to hit that bell to get notifications for all my latest videos, that would be great. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this. Catch you in the next one. Take care. May the force be with you. Bye.